Hey, what's up, guys? This is Jason with SoundDesignStudio.net. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. But this is the next step of um, your X32 creating the custom uh, logo or or um, um, lock screen uh, logo. So this would be your your lock screen setup. So the lock screen have like inverted colors and all that different kind of stuff so i'm not real big on um on how to to do the 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 colors and all that different kind of stuff so um so you'll see what i'm talking about when you create yours so you'll have to kind of go through and 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 kind of fill it out but it makes your colors inverted so you, if you have a a black it might show up blue or white or something like that so you have to kind of play with it but this is the way you create it anyway so uh, create the name of the file and this is in Photoshop I'm just gonna call it um, test all right so you remember your file size have to be 799 by 356 pixels you can do the RGB color for right now and then hit OK so it creates the file now what I want to do is I'll use that color and basically I'll sit there and just put a text on top of that let's say S O U N D oh sorry S I G N S T U D I O and let's put our phone number just So, so now at this point, if anybody opens up the console and they are it's on a lock screen, they know how to contact you. I was saying something looks wrong. The number is wrong. 671. All right. So if somebody's, if they walk up to the lock console, they know how to contact you. But... All right, so now you go over here to where it says uh, image well. It's not popping up for me. All right, where it says image mode, go to indexed right there. Hit flatten. Hit OK. All right, now hit save as. And this one, guys, you have to name as um, boot lock. Uh, custom boot lock, and it has to be a BMP file also but it has to be called custom lock and then the the file type has to be a a dot uh bmp dot bmp file all right so after you have that go ahead and save it and you need it to be 8 bit Windows, hit OK. Now, let's go to the next step. Over to the uh, console. All right, guys, so 
if you saw the first video on how to put the startup page, um, the custom boot on there, you'll see that you, put, you can put the opening logo on there. But we're working on the lock um, button. And you'll see what I'm talking about, about it changes the colors or whatever on your lock screen. So, uh, so when you hold down your home button, it changes to your lock screen. So right now mine is pink. So of course I would change the colors, but as you can see, um, well, from my phone is kind of bright, but you can, you can tell that it is sound design studio on there and it says my phone number and all that kind of stuff uh, on the lock screen. And it is the, it is the lock screen. I can't do anything. So, um, can't do anything. That's the lock screen. So that's, uh, that's how you set that up guys. So hopefully that helps some of you guys out and take it off on lock. So this has been it for sounddesignstudio.net. Hopefully you guys subscribe, hit the subscribe button, and we'll talk to you guys later.